Upadesha on Dharma. Everything has Upadesha, which means what? That a sense of good life, a sense of good behavior, a sense of good thinking, how you should behave in your life, what you should do, and how you should overcome obstacles, because obstacles come every day. So Ramayana and Mahabharata, of course, are our two great epics, which are history and poem at the same time. So these stories are all over, but with different, again, with different views, viewpoints. In some, Draupadi is the main protagonist. In others, it's Duryodhana. In, you know, Duryodhana's temples in Uttarakhand and other places. Did you know that? There are several temples dedicated to Karna. There's, there are temples in Himachal Pradesh to Hidimba, the, uh, uh, the, the wife of Bhima, but she was uh, the Rakshasi, you know, that uh, tribe. And uh, of course, the other temples, temples to Draupadi, even in South India. So it's a very, very eclectic art. The point is that we have 360 viewpoint on everything. That's the Indian mind. The Indian mind believes, but doesn't want to believe also. So there are commentaries on commentaries on commentaries. That's why. I'll give you one simple that there is Gita Ramayana, Ananda Ramayana, and so many Kada, Kambar Ramayana in South, so many Ramayana. These are all tikas, commentaries on the Valmiki Ramayana, Tulsi Ramcharitmanas. 